cut it, cut it, cut it, cut it. Hello beauts, welcome back to my channel. How are you all doing? Oh, for those who are new, my name is Mary. I'm a natural hair lifestyle and beauty content creator from London. In today's video, I plan to be putting some freckles on my face. I want to do a different kind of makeup look. And this was inspired by my friend Sophie, who did a freckles filter on Instagram. And I kind of liked how it looked. So I was like, you know what, I'm going to try doing a makeup version of this. So shout out to Sophie for the inspo. I'll leave her Instagram details below. I've already done my eyebrows because I wasn't actually planning on filming this because I haven't done it before. But might as well, might as well, right? So if you're new to this channel, please subscribe, check out my other videos. I'm sure there'll be something you like. And if you're an old school G, you're not subscribed, but you've watched more than two videos, please. Please, I'm trying to get 300 subscribers before the end of this month. So help you go out. Oh, by the way, I've already primed. Let's see how I do on camera with this look. Anyway, how are you guys? What's new in your world? So in London, lockdown restrictions are finally easing. I heard that there were a lot of people out yesterday, like a lot. So if you're one of those people that were outside yesterday, let me know where you went in the comments below. How is it like feeling or being free? <laughs> Check out my first makeup video link there because it's a bit more descriptive when it comes to the products I use, etc. My base is done. My base is done. My base is done. Oh, I basically just put sp setting spray on my um, beauty blender and I'm just dabbing that highlight in. My neighbour's going in with the music today. I'm hoping you guys, I'm really hoping it's not picked up. If it's picked up, then I'm going to mute this video and do a voiceover. So whilst that bakes, because I do like baking, that's when I do my contour. I think I want quite a heavy contour today, just for definition. Yes. I love it. <laughs> I'm loving it. So I'm just going to go over that contour with my Huda Beauty Benefit and hula toasted you guys i need some more bronzers list below your faves because i'm interested in purchasing it's not every day use the same thing i purchased some new um eyeshadow palettes from beauty bay the other day so can't wait for them to come because there's always this particular pink look I want to do and I don't have it in any of my palettes. To be fair, I've only got three palettes. So even those three is too much because I hardly use them because I don't really know how to do eyeshadow. I'm trying to learn. Which finishing powder do you guys swear by as well? I think that's another step I want to add. Cut it. Cut it. Cut it. Cut it. Cut it. Cut it. Wow. Someone's at the door, guys. Look at God. I was telling you about Beauty Bay. Look what came through. Oh. I'm gonna have a kind of moody look today. But basically, because I'm doing this video, I'm planning a giveaway. So I bought one of the same palette to give away to someone. So there's three palettes here. And then I just got this color lip gloss because i wanted free delivery to be honest i don't know if this is i might put this in a giveaway too to be fair the giveaway one of the conditions is that you have to be following me so you might as well start following me now subscribe to my channel so then you're already qualified partly <laughs> for the giveaway okay so i've cut that let me just Okay, you guys, off camera, I just did my eyes because I wasn't sure what I was doing, but I'm now going in with my blush. I think I'm just going to use the brown and pink combination that I like to use. Actually, I might just do a bit more pink today. Now I'm 
now to highlight i'm actually going to use jackie Ina's palette and i'm going to take pinker with this one going to go in with Matt's Velvet Teddy. This one's contaminated so the colour isn't actually the colour. I don't know if that makes sense. So now for the fun part. A little bit of freckles. Now, on Sophie's filter, the freckles go literally all across here. So that's exactly what I'm going to do. I'm just going to take this eyebrow brown pencil. My mum bought it when I sent her out to do my shopping for me. And I'm just going to create, like, dots. I don't think they're really showing. They are a bit, actually. I'm going to do some black as well. If I had this in brown, I'd definitely use brown because I think black is a bit harsh. But I'm hoping that once I set, we'll turn it down a bit. That one was a large one. Okay, so, <laughs> okay, I think that's enough. I'm definitely going to have to buy brown, a brown liner. That should work. So what I'm going to do is just going to, should I, hmm, hmm, what am I going to do? Feel like that okay so since it's really black and i actually wanted it to be brown i'm thinking to just go over with my foundation brush to make it a bit more subtle so i'm just gonna pat like almost pat into my skin if I had finishing powder, now that's what I would have used because I think it would have done a better job in not making it look so black. What do you guys think? Let me know. Let me know what you think below. Hmm. That's why you don't follow things from Instagram. A few moments later. So you guys, this is the final look. I really tried. I tried, okay? I know what I'm gonna improve for next time, so I'm gonna buy a brown liner to do it with. And yeah, I like it though. It's kinda, I feel like it's a bit more bold in person. I'm hoping it's not as bold on the camera because then it will look a lot better. <laughs> if you give it a go, make sure you show me. You can send me a DM on Instagram. If you have any other alternatives for me to use, let me know down below. Until next time though, please make sure to like, comment, share and subscribe. And I'll see you in my next video. Thank you so much for watching. Bye guys. <laughs>